Hi, welcome to Roller Pump. My name is Brenda. I'm going to take you through our beginner warm up. Hi, we're going to start with ABC calibrations. So you're going to stand on one foot, make an ABC, and put your foot down. And then you're going to put your foot out to the side, ABC, put your foot down, then out to the side side, and ABC, foot down. Then kind of behind you, ABC, put your foot down. And then directly behind you, A, B, C, put your foot down. And then the crossover position, A, B, C, put your foot down. And then we're going to move on to the other side. So A, B, C, put your foot down, out to the side, A, B, C, put your foot down, out to the side side, A, B, C, put your foot down, direct, uh, kind of behind you, A, B, C, put your foot down. Then directly behind you, A, B, C, put your foot down, and cross over, A, B, C, put your foot down. And you're making an A, B, C with your, with your toe stop. Basically, you're wiggling your, your, your skate around to kind of challenge your balance. Next on the list is side steps. So you're going to step together, step together, step together. You can also do a couple of steps, like one, two, three, one, two two just you know step together just work on those side steps and side step side step all right next is stomping so i'm going to stomp and push off and come back up and land so i'm just kind of challenging my balance this is like a juking position in roller derby or roller sports um it's also a dance move but um but it's all kinds of uh, great footwork for you to warm up to. So stomp, stomp, and do little stomps like this to challenge yourself. And that is the stomping drill. What's next? Let's see, what does she do? Now we're gonna lunge. We're lunging and you're just putting all your weight on that knee that you're lunging on. You're lunging that other foot it's not doing anything. All your weight's on the one foot, so you're shifting your weight back and forth. All right, so that was the lunge. Now we're gonna do the heel step. So here I'm lifting my heels up and turning them inward, and I'm gonna get a little closer, so let's fix the camera. All right, camera fixed. So see how this is going? I'm lifting my heels and keeping my front two wheels on the ground to make my my heels do this. All right, so we do that, and then we're going to move to lifting our toes. Now you're lifting your toes, and you're keeping your heels on the ground. So lift your toes, move your heels. Lift your toes, move your heels. All right, so you're gonna do that. That is a great warm up. It gets you used to shifting your weight from your heels to your toes to make different little pivots. All right, so now, um, now I'm just back at an angle and showing you how it is just a great dance move. Um, now we're going to go to bo doing both feet. So I'm lifting my heels and doing a quarter turn. So center, left, center, right, center, left, center, right or left. I don't know what that is. Center, left, center, right, <laughs> center, Left. So I'm lifting my heels to make this quarter turn happen. Lift your heels, your toes stay on the ground. It's a little baby heel lift, toes stay on the ground. So do this, and in a minute we will lift our toes. All right, so now we are lifting our toes. Lift your toes to your quarter turn. Quarter turn, lift your toes. Quarter turn, lift, quarter, quarter turn, lift your toes. Lift your toes, heels on the ground. Stay over your skates. See how I'm kind of bent over my skates? I want you to be like that so you don't end up falling on your tailbone on this one. This one's really um, difficult for most people, but some people like to lift their toes to turn around, and you're going to have to do it if you're going from backwards to forward skating. Um, you will have to do this, so do this. It's a great warm-up. Before you do all your practices, do this warm-up. You'll be a much better skater. All right, next is, let's see what's next. What's next? Now, oh, now we're going to do a 180 with the heel lift. So I want you to turn your upper body first in the direction you want to go, and then flip your butt around. All right, and this is the heel lift. So we're doing this pivot with our heels coming off the ground, keeping our toes on the ground. 
So watch how she pivots first with her upper body and then her hips come. Upper body, then hips. Upper body, then hips. Always have your upper body go first, then your lower body. Upper body, hips. Lift those heels. And you got to lift those heels. If you're stuck to the ground, it's because you're not getting, you're not lifting the heels. So lift the heels, pivot, lift the heels, pivot. Always turn your upper body first. And now I'm coming up, kind of like makes a little dance move. It's fun. It's a great way to pivot. All right, so now we're going to do the super hard one for me. Um, we're going to lift our toes now. Ooh, scary. Lift your toes. We're doing 180s, lifting our toes. Remember, pivot with your upper body first and then your butt. Upper body, and I don't, I'm pointing. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm, I'm talking. And turn. Upper body and hips. Oh, almost fell. Be careful on these. Stay low. Upper body and turn. Upper body and turn. See how I'm low here? Don't come up. Don't, 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 don't. You dare come up until you're like a super advanced skater. Stay low. And upper body, lift your toes and turn. Upper body, lift your toes and turn. I'm lifting my toes on this one. This one's the hard one. I want you to do it anyways, though. It's going to make you an amazing skater. You're going to progress so much quicker with these footwork drills. So do them, do them, do them. And um, let's see what, what we do next. All right, next is our crossover step out drill. So you're going to lift your foot up. And cross over lift your foot up and cross over lift those knees up and cross over lift them up and cross over and we're gonna do a couple of crossovers lift up lift up lift up if you have the space do those but it also wants you to work on rocking back and forth with that crossover left crossover right and lift up cross over lift up Cross over, lift up, cross over. All right, and again, let's do it again. Lift up, cross over, lift up, cross over, lift up, cross over. If you don't have enough space or if you are just, yeah, sometimes you just don't have enough space to do all this, so do them like this, cross over. And here's our advanced move, just cross, 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 but lift those knees lift those knees when you're doing those crossovers do not like do a around the world move of your you know always lift your knees it, it really changes the way a crossover feels if you're lifting your knees and um, eventually you can do stuff like this once you get used to crossovers here's a little dance but that is not part of the warm-up let's see what's next next is mohawk turn so you again are going to point open the book close the book you're going to Open up those heels. You're going to do a heel-heel transition and close off that transition. Heel-heel, close it up. And I'm going fast. I want you to do this fast. Point and step-step. Point, step-step. Make these steps happen super fast. I don't want you to step and hold that position. I want you to point and step-step. And the, the quick feet helps you close off that turn if you hold your feet there forever you're going to you're going to trash this turn so that was the mohawk turn now we're going to work on navigating backwards with a pivot turn um, and uh, i call these butt bombs so you're going to pivot with your heels and go backwards lift your heels and roll backwards and square back up to stop your backwards roll and square up and you know how to do this because we did the pivot quarter turns. And then once you really get it, just start doing a fun dance and make it fun. Wee. Next is the V squat. So you're going to make a V with your feet. Your heels are going to be together. Look down at your feet. Your feet should be making a V. And you're going to do squats. You're going to squat, 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 10 to 15 of them. And the squat is going to open up your hips. All right, and the last thing we're gonna do is called a V turn. So we're making a V and we're turning. V turn, V turn, V or A, V, A, V. And this turn just starts getting you going with, with getting into that two foot spin that you'll eventually learn. And that's our warm up. Thanks for watching. Bye.